and welcome back to a brand new video. So the reason we're going to start off the North Pier is because uh, during Storm Ashley um, on the uh, the Blackpool North um, Pier, part of the uh, Helter Skelter fell into the uh, the North Sea. Um, you know, with those massive winds, what Storm Ashley brought, and part of it is actually washed up ten miles away in Fleetwood. So I'll see if I can find the, uh, the pictures. Uh, part of the uh, health scout what actually washed up in uh, Fleetwood. How about that? The, uh, the light pool displays, which was, uh, I don't think it was actually damaged in Storm Ashley. I thought this would have been the first one to go, you know, with those uh, very delicate lights, like little rods. Uh, but that actually managed, and uh, it was, I think, the last day yesterday, the 26th. So I'd imagine the next time you walk down here, possibly, you know, all this will be uh, disappeared, uh, packed away, ready for, uh, ready for next year. So we're just going to make our way around town because I believe there's been uh, some monsters appearing ready for the monster hunt on some of the roofs. Now I think I uncovered one yesterday uh, in my previous video. I thought it wasn't to do with the monster, but I believe it was. So uh, I think there's a few more appeared. So we're going to go and see if we can uh, track some of these down. Uh, it is quite early in the morning. But the, uh, the clocks went back, so hopefully you reset the clocks. I mean, most of them are automatic um, nowadays, you know, on your cell phones and your alarm clocks. But, you know, imagine that some of the old alarms, you know, they wouldn't. So you possibly could be, uh, you know, sort of getting up an hour too early. But, yeah, enough about the, uh, the clocks. Uh, we're going to head on down the prom, see if we can see some of these monsters, possibly. So we're just the uh, opposite side again of uh, North Pier, and um, what a shot. So you see the uh, like I said, the oranges and everything. It's such a nice time when the uh, the sun's going down or the sun's rising. But you can see it's pan the camera around to the uh, the left hand side, and you can see the uh, the sea is a little bit choppy this morning. Uh, it's a little breezy. There's nothing really to write home about, but yeah, it's a it's still a little bit choppy out there. So that is the uh, one of the latest ones, the uh, Coyote Ugly Saloon, and uh, that's all now opened up. And I, uh, I believe you know it's a it's a fantastic little place. There's a few videos come out what it's like inside, and uh, if you haven't tried that, it might be worth a it might be worth a try. Look how spick and span that one looks. That's a, that's a, probably another great little attraction. And the uh, the famous Blackpool Tower. But just on closer inspection, I can't see any monster up there. I mean, they do start tomorrow, the hunt. So I'd imagine probably sometime today, you may see one lurking um, at the, uh, the top of the tower. And uh, yeah, I just noticed a little, uh, little scooter. It looks like a, if you've lost your scooter, if it's going to be still there, there's a little scooter uh, just on the promenade. That looks like a bit of a swish one, actually. Look at that. That looks a, a nice one, that one. So if you have lost your scooter, it's just uh, situated um, just on the, uh, the promenade. So yeah, what we'll do, we'll move on, because I believe there's a couple, um, I think one on the uh, Coral Island, I believe, um, and there's a couple more around. So uh, yeah, we'll go and see if we can find, I think it's about sort of two or three, what's popped up so we can uh, we can see if we can find those I'm not so sure what's going on with that seedle he's just sort of nestled and oh there he is there he's going looks like it's a, a little baby one he doesn't look very well actually 
I'm not too sure what's uh, what size is going to be uh, going to be sick. Look at that. Yeah, he doesn't look well, does he? Oh, there he goes. Yeah, so I can't see one on the uh, the Blackpool Tower. Um, like I said, one will appear later on. I'd imagine today, lurking down, overlooking the uh, the comedy carpet, and that's the uh, situation at the moment. You can see how quiet it is in a couple of hours, and this will be a uh, absolutely heaving again later on today. So if you've been watching my uh, videos for a while, you know me by now, I can't resist um, just having a look at this sea. Uh, especially, you know, I love it when it's sort of choppy and it's rough, it just brings that sort of magical feeling to it. And you can see today, it's not, it's not that too bad to be fair. And it's a little bit choppy, so the tide looks like it's, uh, it's on its way in. In fact, you know, I'd say it's on its way out, I haven't checked the high tides, but just having a, a quick look, pan the car around to the left, you can see where there's the beach is, uh, is slightly wet. It is, looks like it's going out, so that's fantastic for everybody on the, uh, the early morning walk. And there we go, we found our first monster lurking near Coral Island. There he is, and you can see the teeth on him. Look at the teeth and his claws. So if you haven't seen that one, there we go. That's our first one, just near Coral Island. And uh, I wonder if these uh, light up at night. If they light up, you know, sort of uh, the inflatables, that'll be fantastic. That'll be really good. So that's our first one, just near Coral Island. So we don't have to walk too far because we've seen our second one, which is just near sea life. And that looks like a, a gigantic octopus looks like. So uh, yeah, we're gonna have a, a close look at this one as well, because this is our second one, what's uh, appeared. And there he is. You can see it looks like a five, looks like five eyes on this one, which is just near the sea life. And uh, he's done in all that purple and uh, that's the second one uh, of the monster. So I believe there's quite a few of them. And uh, yeah, so that's the second one. So if you're having a stroll down the other uh, promenade, you've got a bit of a head start um, with the monsters. And that's just near sea life. So look at this, like a, he's possibly like an octopus, a five-eyed octopus, uh, just near the sea life. Uh, just look at the uh, huge pieces of driftwood uh, was washed up in Blackpool. Huge, huge. And, you know, that's the, uh, that's the South Pier. I, I do apologise, the Central Pier. And how lovely does that look? You can see the, uh, the tide looks like it's going out, and that looks fantastic. And it just looks uh, magnificent, like I said, the, uh, the Central Pier. The waves, like I said, the tide is on its way out. And look at that, I just... Uh, such a fantastic uh, view. First thing in the morning, it's things like this, you know, you take for granted. Uh, just listening to the, uh, the waves of the sea. And, yeah, you see, the, like I said, the sea is a little choppy, but it's not too bad. And what a walk. You know, you go all the way from uh, miles and miles, all the way to Cleves if you wanted to. So there's a little group of crows. Now they seem to be sort of pecking at the sand. So if you do know, let me know what they're sort of pecking away at. Uh, I don't know if it's like any like worms or anything like that, but yeah, they're sort of pecking away at the sand. It's a, uh, let me know what they're pecking for. And this is the, uh, the third one we've discovered, which is just uh, on top of the show town. And uh, I'm not too sure what this one is supposed to be, but yeah. Uh, it looks quite friendly, this one. Uh, a couple of eyes, I've like, got feelers and a, a bit of a nose, but yeah, just near the uh, show town. And that's the uh, third one of the morning we have discovered. So we're just near the Winter Gardens and uh, I was led to believe um, there was a monster 
just on top of the other box office opera house. But uh, on the getting here, I can't see any to be fair. Unless it's done a bit of a runner. Who knows? But yeah, apparently there's supposed to be another one lurking uh, on the top of the, uh, the winter gardens. And uh, like I said, on closer inspection, you know, I can't see uh, any monster on the roof unless it appears later on. Um, yeah, there's, uh, there's nothing at the moment, but at least we'll give you a bit of a head start. I hope it's not a spoiler for you. At least you've uh, had a bit of a head start on where some of the, uh, the monsters are. I believe there's 10 of them, 10 huge inflatables. So we'll have a look, see if we can find uh, one or two more. But like I said, we've still got a day to go, so I imagine they'll be uh, popping them up later on today or overnight. So we're just heading down uh, Talbot Road and uh, this sort of leads all the way to the, uh, the nightclubs, the trilogy and all sorts down this way. Uh, so this is like the, uh, the main part of town, a couple of hundred feet where everyone goes for a bit of a night out, all the, uh, the clubs and the, uh, the late night pubs. But yeah, it's a shame we've only sort of discovered three, but I suppose that's the, uh, the whole point of the, uh, the monster hunt. Um, so I'll pop everything in the uh, description about that one. Like I said, it starts tomorrow. I think it goes on till the 3rd of November, if I'm uh, not mistaken. So yeah, that'll be a, a great activity. And uh, yeah, like I said, uh, it's, it's fantastic, you know, these events, what Blackpool do hold. Um, you see the, uh, the Trilogy nightclub there. Once that gets very, very busy at night time. And uh, just whip the camera around to the left. And uh, you see that stunning building, look at that. That's magnificent. And the, uh, the new uh, Starbucks will be going to the, uh, the Four Shores Hotel on the, uh, the bottom floor. So they're already carving the, the way through there, uh, get everything ready. So I wonder if the, uh, the one in town, the Starbucks in town will uh, close down so I wouldn't imagine they've had two, you know, a few hundred feet from each other. So, uh, yeah, that'll be, a, that'll be a great one when it does come. So I hope you enjoyed that uh, bit of a walk around, early morning walk around when the, uh, the clocks go back. And uh, it gives you a bit of a head start if you're planning on uh, taking part in that monster hunt. And, uh, yeah, so like I said, if you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button if you do like the, uh, the videos we put out. Uh, any comments I will try to get back to you and make sure you hit that like button and until next time take care of yourselves and enjoy the rest of your day. Bye bye.